Today I'm making an onion board. It's a Jewish flatbread. I remember this from my father's bakery and I decided to try to make it. We first have to make the dough. I'm using my bread machine to make mine because I have a dough setting. If you're using a bread machine like I am, place your liquids in first. Begin with one and a quarter cups of warm water, then add in two tablespoons of olive oil. Next, add in your flour. You'll need three cups of unbleached flour. Then add in two teaspoons of salt and one teaspoon of sugar. Finally, add in two and a quarter teaspoons of yeast. Then you can start your machine. done, place it into a bowl with some olive oil. Then rub a little olive oil on top of the dough and cover it with a towel. And then allow it to rise for about an hour until it doubles in size. While the dough is rising, peel and dice two medium-sized onions. That should equal about three cups of diced onion. Don't forget to remove the hard core on the onion. When you finish dicing your onions, place two tablespoons of good olive oil in a pan and saute the onions until they are translucent. This should take about 15 to 20 minutes. As your onions are cooking, keep moving them around in the pan so that they don't stick. After the onions have been cooking for about 15 minutes, sprinkle in about a teaspoon of salt and mix that together. And turn off the burner and allow the onions to cool. Next, brush some olive oil onto a parchment lined baking sheet. Then stretch your dough onto the pan. The dough should be sticky and pliable. Your fingertips to stretch the dough into the pan. You want it to be fairly thin. Once you've stretched your dough into the pan, allow it to rest for about 30 minutes. Then you can go ahead and place your onions on top of the dough. Take another little bit of olive oil and just brush around the edges of the dough. And then you can sprinkle the top with some poppy seeds and sea salt.
Bake your onion board in a 425 degree oven for about 30 minutes or until it is nicely browned. After about 15 minutes, just go into the oven and turn the pan. And allow it to continue baking. When the bread is done baking, transfer it to a wire rack to cool before slicing.